Hey folks, and welcome back for some more Battletech. Um, we did a few missions last time with our newer pilots to get them skilled up, but this time around, we're going to be doing some more difficult missions. So we'll be using our main pilots. Although there's this one school, it's an ambush convoy. We could do that with our younger pilots as well. So why don't we go ahead and get that out of the way, actually. Radio wave will go there. Okay. And looks good, so we're off. So I already had my coffee for the morning. Normally I record at night, but I didn't record last night, so I thought I'd record in the morning and get our Mech Warrior and Battletech uh, playthroughs synced up. Then uh, I think I might start another Stellars campaign. Because if you haven't watched the other one, it, uh, Welcome to Maybe nowhere. something happened that caused it to go short. I'm sure you can figure out what that is. And these guys are actually pretty close to the escape point. Of course. Confirmed. So we're gonna try and head them off at the pass. Feel like they can make it there in two turns and yeah i feel disadvantaged here i understand anything nothing maybe they're a little bit farther back than that maybe that's where they want us to go rather than their actual escape point copy that confirmed I've got eyes on the target. Okay. Okay. Yep, so they are a little bit farther back. I kinda wish I rushed into this these areas, although I guess here we wouldn't be able to see them. Wish that kind of panning circle thing was a little bit more slow. I don't know, it's kind of jarring. I feel like it'd be jarring to watch. I like the responsiveness as as a player, but at the same time, just thinking about it uh, as a viewer, a little bit too quick of a switch. A phoenix hawk. Yikes. Okay. 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 Moving to position. Um. Okay, and that's another mech. Oh boy. I go up, I should put... Let's see, yeah. These, the Cicada in general run out no. here. I'll send the Firestarker and the Vulcan up on this little ridge. What's this other mech? Awaiting orders. Oh. Let's see. We're about to find out. A locust. Okay. Not too bad. Firestar or the Phoenix is relatively easy to hit here. Oh boy. Let's see. Looks like a standard model with a few lasers and machine guns on it. Oh man. That thing's kind of scary. Yikes. Yep. Ow. Ow. What do you need? See, so yeah. oh, sweet. I can get up into short laser range. 
Understood. We need to get rid of this guy. Pronto. This guy's dangerous. Should I save the large laser? No. No, we're not saving it. Alright, we got some hits. We critted the large laser, that's good. Oh yeah. Now the locusts go. Yeah. Oh. Uh oh, that's not good. Okay. That was really bad. Yeah. Um wow, they're hitting my center torso on the Vulcan. Aye aye. Uh, this cicada here. It's going to make this locust Moving think out. about their choices. There's all of our targets, I assume. Our objective targets, I should say. Yeah, two SRMs Let's on it. See. See. Like ah, come on. Come on. No joy. Yeah. These guy. Oh, these guys got guns too. Yep. Good to go. Get behind it. Oh, can't get behind it. I can't really get very much evasion on this either. Um, I might just do this. So we need to get rid of this guy. Even though that locust is pretty... Pretty dangerous with those SRMs. I want to get rid of this Phoenix Hawk. We should focus fire, right? So... I get more evasion anywhere? Here. Chance to hit's the same, I believe. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. On. All right. Got rid of a good amount of weapons there. I think there's three Order weapons in that arm. We might have to send the cicada after the targets while everyone else deals with these two mechs. Otherwise, they're going to get away. Oof. Okay. Um, maybe not, because it seems like these targets are actually pretty nasty. Yeah. Hang on. I'm going to take a look at these guys. AC5, AC5, AC20... Uh, AC5. Okay. Um, yeah, we definitely uh, took over half the firepower away from the Phoenix Hawk, which is nice. Um, reporting. Our Vulcan is incredibly hurt, so we should jump. Let's see. Our left arm is what's hurt, but I don't want to show our center torso to those tanks. Um... So I'm going to jump behind this rock, like this, to protect our arm and our center torso. And we'll keep wailing into the right side of this Phoenix Hawk. Uh, how much... The Ultra AC2 actually creates a decent amount of heat. So let's, uh, let's not shoot it, because I think we might... We're I'm pretty sure it gives a recoil penalty as well if you fire it consecutively. So we'll save heat and hit chance for next time. And possibly jumping. I've never seen a locust go so slow. Ow. That shot went internal. That's the first time they were hit. Yes, Commander. I guess oh the arm? Okay. That's just how weak the arm is. Uh, we're gonna move here. Get some cover from the rock and the storm. It's gonna expose an arm. I don't think. Yeah, there's nothing in our arm, so I won't be sad if we lose it. But yeah. I'm actually going to 
run up and punch this guy. Or shoot him. 68. Versus 81%. Yeah. I'm going to run up and sock this guy with a fire starter. Just putting my weight into it. Before he jumps away. Nice. We got a hit. Ooh, I think everything hit there. Nice. So we got rid of his uh, right torso. Alright, and the machine guns. He didn't fire. Oh, he's out of range probably. That's why. Alright. Next. Ooh. This Jenner is going to... I get like a shot advantage somewhere here. Jenner's going to go up here. I wish I had uh, some resolve so I could focus fire the back of this thing. Move order received. And then after this, we're going to move this cicada over into this uh, dust devil area. I copy. Nice. Nice. That SRM explosion, Hot ammo body. explosion, I think, did it for us. Oh. Oof. Oof. I'm taking internal damage. Yeah. Standing by. Oh, that's a torso too. Um, we need to, we need to move it. We need to move it. Moving out gonna reduce our damage if we get hit but skate has been getting a pounding like the Vulcan fortunately we the torso twist on the cicada is garbage so we're not able to target our primary targets but we can at least take a, a pot shot at the Phoenix Hawk all right miss me hopefully all these guys miss me Miss me. Miss me. Yes, Commander. Yes, Commander. Uh, we're going to... Aye, aye. Still a decent amount of blips. We're going to use the yep. fire starter to run up and punch again, I suppose. I wish we would get evasion for moving over here. More than just one blip. I feel like that's a little dangerous. Um, yeah. Let's see. So we're gonna generate heat. Maybe going through here. Um. Hmm. Maybe we should move back. Kind of kite them away from us. That means we can't hit the Phoenix Hawk with all of our stuff. If we go here, we can. And we'll have an average. I mean, I say average, we'll have a little bit of evasion. I could jump, but I'll do what I can. Hot planet, and I get some heat from walking through that. Let's drop the large laser. Yeah, that does it for us. And we're going to uh, maybe we should do this. Drop a small laser. Chance to hit? No. Okay. Um, we do have some resolve though. How much is? We're going to have to hit with, actually, I don't think we, well, no, yeah, we can get him if we hit with four in the center torso, but I don't know. He, he, it's possible if we'll survive this. I'm taking a shot. Yeah. Okay. 
I don't like that. Might move the cicada Thanks next. Commander? Because those tanks are going to be going after them. Um, there's no cover around, though, to... I don't want to run closer because that would assist their... They're firing at me. Um, I mean, I'm going to run out. I'm going to run out and shoot at them. Good luck. Primary target All right. damage. Concentrate your fire and bring it down. Wish both hit, but you know. Oh right, yeah, and they're gonna move closer. I probably shouldn't have moved out. Awaiting orders. Out here. Our Ultra AC5 has decent chance to hit from there. High ground? Oh here we go. Here we go. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Um, I don't have double targeting with him yet. And the center torso is pretty bad looking, so... Maybe I should just do the Phoenix Hawk. Oh, let's, um, let's start moving towards where the convoy is going, actually. That's what we'll do. No, stay with him. We'll stay out of the... Well, they can move up, so I was going to say the firing range of the other tanks, but oh well. Come on, kill him, kill him. Okay. Expose some structure on the tank. Yes, Commander. Radio wave. It's time for you to show us what you're made of. Oh, you're really hot though. The heat is off the charts. We can shoot three medium lasers, and we're on the side that we need to be targeting, so hopefully. Alright, one's down. Concentrate your fire and bring it down. Oh, he blew off our right arm. I thought it was our left arm that was damaged. Guess I'm wrong. Oof, yeah, that C20 is going after the cicada. We might just need to run up and stomp on him. Reporting. Yeah. I guess my other arm was damaged as well. Didn't notice that. Of course. This might be a mistake. It's fine, we'll just get cored, you know? No big deal. Uh, I want the... I want the higher chance to hit on this AC-20 guy. In fact, can I make it 78, 78? Yeah. Wow, there's a lot of armor in the front, so... We should target it's the right. Yeah, we should target the right side. Come on. Target acquired and locked in. Okay. Ah, leave me alone. Awaiting orders. run up and stomp them. Uh, it does do double damage. What's the 
the chance to 88 versus 68. Oh, well, it's not that bad if. Okay. So, yeah, it's in rough terrain, so it'll be harder to melee it. Do I just run up and punch this thing? Is that is that what I should do? That AC-20 is scary, though. That AC-20 is scary, though. Okay. I'm thinking too much, and I just gotta choose something. Um, I'm afraid... Well... I go here is shoot I have okay I'm afraid of this AC 20 so that's what I'm going at. Affirmative. unfortunately we're on the opposite side though so what do you need run up punch this guy that's what I need get him Got it. Get him. Nice. Wasted some uh, heat there with down. that, but okay. Waiting for orders. Uh, the Jenner here. How much melee damage do you do? 35. That equals a total of 70. Versus the hundred that our medium lasers can do. One of these. Okay. We go over here. Yep. Got it. Move it. Move it. It's giving me a blip, like I'm gonna overheat, but it's not saying anything does that mean we're gonna hit like exactly our heat see i thought we hit oh it must have been a different tank that we hit on the other side oh oh boy here we go he's gonna he's gonna machine gun me uh Okay. Vulcan's in trouble. All right. Yes, Commander. Well, let's kind of come over here and herb stomp this guy. Have no doubt, it will be done. Yep. Good. Oh, of course you miss. The uh, CQC suite was destroyed, so that's why. Aye, aye. Or, I mean, that's not why, but that certainly didn't help. Yeah, come and stomp this boy. Stomp, stomp. Roger that. Stomp, stomp. Attesting physical attack. Okay, one down. Two more to go. Let's get this done. And These uh, AC-5s and yep. machine guns can still hurt quite a bit, so... Still gotta be careful. Um, I guess we're just going to move along the ridge here. I don't think we're going to be able to shoot anything. Okay, we will. Alright, we hit two. Nice. Uh, radio wave. Radio wave is running pretty hot, so we're going to run up and punch. Moving out. Stop him. Oh boy, a miss. 
failed to connect. Oh man, that poor Vulcan. You're gonna shoot him, aren't you? Ooh. He missed. Same thing. Damn it! Wounded. Okay. Shot in the face. Poor Buzz here is getting knocked around. Uh oh. Awaiting orders. Go stomp on him, man. Show him who's boss. Show me you're not afraid, even though you, you might get cored. Okay, there we go. One left. Reporting enemy vehicle eliminated. Yes, Commander. Right. On the move. Get him. Get him. Giving him everything I've got. Get him. Yeah. Let's move. Get him. Get him. Aye, aye. Engaging target. Receiving you. Aye, aye. Run up and shoot him in the butt. Get him. Should I use this? Does it in no, it doesn't increase my chance, so... Goodbye. I'm coming in hot. I don't think we need to. We killed everything, right? Yep. Here we go. Mission successful. I don't need no evac. Just pick me up. Everything's dead. Oof. We took a good amount of damage there, though. Um, I don't particularly like the Phoenix Hawk. But I like it better than a lot of the mechs that we have, so... Uh, we got the AC-5 and 20, that's nice. I kind of wish we got some machine guns, because we lost one, I'm sure, on the Vulcan, but we have extras anyway, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I know. I know. We gotta fix our mix. Alright. And repair. Place the arm. Need to drop a machine gun. That should be everything. I'll repair structure. All right. Good to go. Only three days right. for that. I'll get it in the schedule. And one day for the cicadas internal structure damage. So we'll go back to contracts and. Mm, I I would like to do this assassination mission to get whatever salvage I can. But it's it's a two skull, which makes me a little nervous. If I ignore the escorts on our target, I can only choose up to two max salvage. What to do? What to do? Or we could just go do the destroy base. The salvage on this one goes up pretty high. I want max salvage. Um, what I'm thinking is I might only be able to do one of these either way. Commander on deck. Because I have to wait a few days. We're trying to get up to this flashpoint. We're flying out here after. So, it expires in 83 days. And, yeah, it's going to take half of that. It's going to get hey, ate up by travel time. Although that flashpoint is a two school. Which makes me kind of nervous. Um, we're going to try it. We're going to try this. We're going to try it. And we're going to get at least two selected salvage. So whatever mech this guy is piloting, we can. Oh, we got to wait. We got to wait. 
I forgot. We're going to try and get as many pieces of our target's mech as possible. That is, if it's a mech that we want, after all. It may not be anything that we really care for, but I think just about it. anything but scout mechs is better than what we have, and I doubt that the target will be in a scout mech, so take out our pilots and put in the A-team. Alright, boys. I need you. I need you to do your best this time around. Alright. Cross your fingers. Cross your fingers. Hopefully we don't get dropped right between our target and their escort. I've had that happen a lot, but... Okay. Command interface initiated. Well, that's cool. A little dam. I don't think I've seen a dam on a map yet. Okay. Of course, her escort is between us. And I didn't see what mech they were in. I wasn't paying attention. That's great. Um, we are going to go along this ridge. Oh, hang on. We have the Jenner and the Cicada, which can't jump. But looks... Okay, yeah, there's a road down over here. So, um, and this road, hopefully will help us get away. Okay, so you can run up here. Hopefully get it help us get away from oh, we're gonna get targeted if we go there. Is there a way up on this far side? We could run all the way around maybe. Uh yeah it's within the see the edge of the map over there. It's within the map so we could run around like that. But this ridge, I don't think they would be able to go up. Let's see. Yeah. I don't think we'll be able to go up on that ridge. So we're kind of stuck. Um, with this ridge here, we're being funneled right into their escort. Mm. If we had all mechs with jump jets, this would be uh, pretty nice, but... It's not the case, unfortunately. So, we're going to make the best of the hand that we were dealt. And... Sprint up onto this ledge. See a Valkyrie. It's not too bad. Acknowledged. You betcha! Okay, I see three or four mechs out here. Yikes. Yikes. A wasp. Okay. Er, no, maybe just three. Okay. The Valkyrie is the most concerning. Oh, there's a mech up here. Actually, this guy is the most concerning now. Can I... Let's see, I might as well just run to here. What is this? A griffin. Yikes. Okay, this guy is definitely the most concerning. And he has all close range weapons. So, we're going to uh, beeline it along this road and hopefully surround and kill this guy. Oh man, two school mission, y'all. <laughs> this this might have been a mistake, but you know, we'll see. Um, we do have a better chance to hit the wasp, but we we gotta we gotta get this griffin down. We at least got two hits on him. Pretty sure the Valkyrie 
has jump jets. So, yeah, that's why I don't really like the Valkyrie, because they're, they're going to be hitting us with indirect fire constantly. I wish we could see him from this corner, but I guess not. Um, I mean, Mamba has bulwark as well, so I guess we'll just take advantage of the cover. If we keep hitting this right torso, it would be really nice. Oh, leg in the right torso, it looks like. Alright, what is this? Can we... A locust. Okay. So... My plan is to go after this griffin. 100%. We're going after the griffin. We'll stick with that plan. I don't think it's gone yet, and I don't really want to be here for it to get a straight shot off. But I, I just want to get as close to it as possible. Or I could jump with the fire starter. But I don't have anywhere as good to jump to. How can I not hit him from here? It's strange. Strange, strange, strange. Uh, but we're not gonna jump because that costs heat. Yeah, I don't, I don't like this, but location confirmed. We're going up here. Hopefully, the stray shot doesn't come to fruition. I think we got a center torso hit, which is good. Waiting on you, commander. And Unfortunately, our Jenner may not... Oh, here we go. Yeah. It's going to build up a lot of heat, but... I feel like we should just go for it. Firing everything I've got. Pretty, pretty good progress. He's unsettled. Um, now he's going to shoot at us. Yeah. Gave us a good smack there. That's probably our target moving in the background there. Oh. Here we go. We can move over here and shoot him with just about everything. This gets us out of sight of the um, the friendlies down low. Unfortunately, we don't have any cover. I could use Vigilance. I'm gonna use... well, I could use it now, because killing this guy would be ideal, right? We could disarm them, but then they could run and punch us. And I'm sure a griffin punch will really hurt. How much is on our center torso? I think we just gotta go for a center torso, right? We're gonna do it. We're doing it. All right. Nice. We disarmed him. Critical damage detected. Ow. Stop it. We're moving the cicada next. Where is he at? Mamba. Here we go. We're gonna... I don't want to run up into his face. Ah, the cicada's center, the cicada's torso twist is horrible. Um, I kind of have to run up into his face, and I don't want to do that. Could melee him. I could move here. Um, I guess I'm moving here, right? Shame. What a shame. You gotta kill it. Fortunately, we're going to go before it does, so hopefully we'll be able to take it out and get a line of sight of the guys down in the valley. 
They'll probably jump up behind us if we don't take care of them, though, I'm thinking. Roger. Sure you don't want to eject? Inflicted. There we go. Nice. There's the Valkyrie. Alright. Commander. Uh, we're going to move along the ridge because this wasp has SRMs and that locust has SRMs. So we're going to start focusing on... this Valkyrie from on high. I copy. Shoot him. Copy that. Uh. Ha! Send me a real opponent. Oh, here we go. Big chance to hit. Move it out. Lots of heat, though, but... Take this. What else are genders for if you don't turn them into toasty coffins? Good jump up here. Yeah. Guess I'm just gonna jump here. Stay away from me. Get away. Standing by. Eighty percent. There we go. What about here? Uh, he would get damage reduction versus one one blip of evasion. I'll take the. Uh, the damage reduction. Affirmative. Hopefully we don't lose its leg because chasing down a target, our assassination Locked target, target, might be a little difficult if we lose a leg. Okay. Orders? I think we are getting a uh, a extra amount of cover from being up high. I think that's a thing, right? You get a better chance to hit while they get a lower chance to hit if you're above them. What can I do for you? could uh, waylay into the wasp right now. It's close enough. It doesn't have any cover and no evasion. Can I get any evasion myself? There we go. Look at this. Uh huh. Look at this. May not have enough heat capacity. Yep, we don't. So I'll have to drop a laser, unfortunately. I think they're his lasers in the right the hand, I'm pretty sure. Uh -huh. Oh boy. Okay. Whoever's in that thing, uh 
think that's an AC2, right? AC2 is fired twice. Unless it, it has a Ultra AC5 or something. So it's coming at us. Which is concerning. I, I jump here. Oh, I can actually hit the wasp with machine guns from here. It's interesting. I jump down closer. 42 versus 42. It's the same. No, it's actually higher and then 57 versus 62. Uh, kind of a trade off here. But I'm going to jump down. Engaging jump jets. Get some cover. Split fire. Between these two guys. Fire away. Multiple targets. Oh. Get him. So now I'm thinking we're going to start moving back the other way. Because it seems like our target is actually coming to join the fight. And we're doing halfway decent against these guys. So we're going to continue to use the cover to our advantage. Or our... Uh, Elevation and this cover to our advantage if we can. Yes, Commander. See, the fire star is not hot at all. So if I jump here, can't see him. If I jump here, can't see him. If I jump here, okay. Maybe we can eliminate the wasp. I'm gonna go for it. Gonna go for it. Engaging jump jet. Firestar is gonna get toasty himself now. Fire all the things. Get him. There we go. One less target. They, they might start focusing on the cicada because it has an exposed structure. And uh, we need to move... We need to move them away, right? It's a funny... <laughs> this locust has the bulwark skill. It's a funny skill to have on a locust. Um... See. Yeah, it's the arm and the leg. Um We're gonna we're gonna keep moving down this ridge the other direction. And then we're kinda gonna move one way and then move back the other way. Um to guide in our target while we take care of these guys and then move back to attack our target. Get him. Taking the shot. Got a hit. I would like more than just a hit, though. Locust is just going to stay in those trees, I guess, for that cover. Let's I hear see. you. We go here. We can get a decent amount of evasion if we run over here, though. Uh, our assassination target might be able to get us from over there, but he's really far off. We'll take our chances. Toasty Jenner. There we go. Nice. We got rid of the when LRM. You, I'm pretty sure like the LRM is in that torso that we just blew up. Oh boy, what is this thing? Um... Is it a rifleman? I feel like there's a rifleman with two eight two auto cannons and large lasers on it. 
Oh boy. Okay. Um. That's uh concerning. Concerning indeed. Um. Should we jump down? We can't get behind him or anything. What we could do is ignore the locust until it gets up on the ridge with us, maybe. Um. Oh. Okay. Well. I was going to jump up here anyway. Ha! Joke's on you. Ah, come on. Enemy mech. Critical damage Eject? No, not ejecting. Aye, aye. Alright, so... We're going to try and get that medium laser off this Valkyrie. And then I think we might semi ignore this locust so over here coordinates received get him Locked up. you gonna eject no you're not gonna eject okay yeah those SRMs though oh boy what's up boss Fire starter. Oh, we could run over here and hit the locust in the back. It jump behind it. I don't know what happened to the to the camera there. Um, hmm. I could do this, but then I I have no evasion, and I want to get behind him in case he has bulwark. So my only choice there is to jump. I could jump here, and I could jump back up. If I need to. Although I have a lot of heat. Um, yep, this is what we're doing. Affirmative. Yeah. We're going to fire as much as we can into the back of them. Which is not much at all. Um, in fact, we might... Is we, are we better off with just... No, I can't do the large laser by itself. Oof. Um, we get one small laser. This might have been a mistake. Oh well. Locked on. Rear armor. Negative damage. Waiting on you, Commander. Um... Okay, move along a little bit. Do I want to move back? I'm going to move back, actually. Because if we can... Yep, we're moving back, actually. Keep uh, moving back and forth between these two cover points. I guess you can't see the locust from there. That's strange. Or you can't target it. Kind of funny. Move over here. Shoot him. Alright, hopefully we can get him to panic or something. Nice. We're actually able to pour him. Alright, what is this thing? Ooh. Ooh. 
Warning. Armor low. Whatever it is, it's it's coming and it's scary. Oh. Um, Alright, now. Good to go. Now it's time for you to punch this guy. And it's back. Here we go. Get him. Um, get him. Um. Moving out. There we go. Die. Nice. Mech destroyed. All right, we're able to deal with his escorts relatively easily. Um, now. Ready for orders. See if I sprint. How much evasion? I don't get any more evasion from sprinting. What's up with that? Um. Now we're going to run the cicada down over here. Maybe. I hear we you. could run servers out here and sensor lock them. Yeah. We'll do that. No sweat. Got a lock. It is a rifleman. Okay. I was correct. Uh, so I can jump over here. I actually have a pretty good chance to hit being so far off. Um, that's nice. We're going to jump down into cover. And blah, blah. Okay, so it also has medium lasers on it. Something we need to be aware of. I think I'm going to run the cicada around. Try and get behind it. In which case, I might as well just sprint, right? No Riflemen don't jump have jump run. jets. Hopefully, reinforcements don't arrive. That would be unfortunate. Okay, Jenner. Time for you to dip and dive and duck and dip and dive. Just here. There we go. We can move up here or here. There we go. We'll move here. Sure. Moving out. Right, we're kind of close, though. That might be a mistake considering the damage on this guy. I, I, I always say that. Is this a bad idea? Is this a bad idea? It's kind of weak on armor, though. So. Receiving you. Can I shoot from here? No. Oh yeah, I can. Uh, if I jump, that's so much heat. So I think... Oh, mistake. By. Uh, there's this ridge here that I could take advantage of as well. Um, so I'm going to run here. Try to dissipate some heat. Take a shot with my large laser. Then run up this hill to create like a funnel effect. And we have this resolve, this building up that we're gonna have to use on this guy too. Alright. Looks like he's able to keep his evasion. What can I do for you? Wish we could get closer, but it is what it is. Oh well. Might use a precision strike. 
because uh, the Jenner does have a decent amount of weapons. It's a pretty big boost. Um, and if we're able to destroy or crit something before he fires, that might be a good idea. Let's see what's in this. So there's a laser there. We're going to go for this torso. All weapons are go. I don't think we hit it once. We did crit a There's medium blazer. Where that came from. I forgot what searchlights do. But. Good move here. We are moving closer to him, which is concerning. But. Er, well, we can't really show him our left side. We can only show him our right side. So I guess we're going to show him our front. And pray that he doesn't. Blow off our nice shiny mech parts. Um, here we go. Keeping in his evasion. Uh, from there, I think he's gonna target the Vulcan. Yep. Okay. Okay. We lost the jump jet, but. Warning. Damage critical. The target is retreating, Commander. Eliminate it before it escapes. Okay. So we're going to be behind it, which is super unfortunate for the Jenner and Cicada because they don't have jump jets. Um, I hear you. That's not good. Um, that, and we can't shoot them from here, apparently. That is not good. It's not good. Receiving you. Can't get into range of our small lasers either. Okay, so if we look at the terrain, it's gonna go around this side here, right? It's gonna go around over there. So um Luckily, the fire starter can follow him over the hill with jumping. Um, 78 versus 78. So we might run. We're going to run the fire starter into cover here. On Save on our heat again as much as we can. And someone's going to have to target this leg with a. Uh, it might be the Jenner, I think. Might target the leg with the Jenner. If someone can get close and do a lot of damage, it would be really nice. So. Target acquired. Wrong leg. Or maybe that's the right leg. Hang on. Yeah, wrong leg. Um, but that's actually the leg we want to hit now. Orders. Um. Oh man, I'd be pretty, pretty salty if this guy escapes after all this. We did so well so far. Come on, hit him in his legs, man. Firing on target. All right, one hit in the leg. And the chinner. Um. Jenner. Jenner's pretty hot. Eighty percent from here, though. That's pretty nice. What about from here? Oh, it's blocked. So, I mean, our, I kind of feel like our only choice here is to fire as much as we can and take whatever, take whatever damage we get from them. Um, here we go. Off leg, man. Well, I'll take that. Yeah, critical hit. Uh, 
Oh yeah, our jump jet was destroyed on this guy. Oof, he hit a center, center torso. Um, that's why we can't jump nearly as far. Could just move here. We get more for jumping, but then we can't target with our medium laser. And right now we kind of need damage output, right? All right, so our damaged torso is the right torso, so we'll show them our left side as much as we can. So I don't want to lose another Ultra AC2. That would be bad news. And I don't know if I want to use our resolve on this. I think we can use it twice, and it might actually be a good idea because our fire starter is going to be able to use it once as well. If we can focus on his legs, then whatever is more damaged, this one. If we can get his legs off, it'd be really nice. Oh, or we can just have him eject. Nice. Mission successful. Nice. Man, hopefully I get lucky and get a lot of griffin and rifleman parts. That would be very enticing indeed. So there's two rifleman parts and one griffin part, even though they ejected. Okay. Um, well, two parts is better than one, right? So we're going after the rifleman. And we got the griffin part too. That's awesome. We got a lot of parts actually. Alright, so we gotta find another Rifleman and Griffin now. That went pretty good. In fact, I think we might be able to do the other mission before we leave. Um, running a little bit long, but that's okay. Um, so last it said 83 days, so that mission took 4 days. Uh, if we go to our mech bay here... Um, have to refit because we lost a jump jet. Equipment. Jump jet small. There we go. That takes one day. Right. I'll get it in the Cicada just has structure damage. That takes one day. So that's two more days. Another, another mission will take like four days maybe. And it's the one and a half skull destroy base mission. So, I think we'll take that mission and then continue on our journey up towards that flashpoint. And we might just jump there from here instead of wasting any more ta time along the way. Uh -oh. But before we do that, can we give anybody any cool skills? You. We can. Let's see, Butchers and the Fire Starter. So he's a... He's a run and smack guy. It's a melee guy that we're trying to get up and running. Cerberus is a sniper. Whenever we actually get a sniper mech. Mamba is going to be a gladiator. Training confirmed, Commander. And I am trying to get a gladiator skill set as well. Um. Aye, aye. Commander. And the new guys. Yeah, you guys don't have any big hey, things to worry about right now because we're not going to use them. So, um, I don't think we're work. Okay, we are upgrading something in progress. And let's let the repairs happen. That work order you submitted Boom. is complete. So now we're all set up and ready to take the next mission for next time. All right, um, that was pretty exciting. We got uh, all the parts we wanted. I wish there would have been more Griffin parts if they ejected or, you know, that's the way it goes. Uh, thanks for watching, y'all. I'll talk to y'all later.